In this video, I'm going to explain to you how you can get a Facebook Ads API long lived access token. What does that mean? Uh, you can use the access token to programmatically call the Facebook Ads Manager, make uh, reporting calls or change things and do that with the same access token for up to 60 days. So you don't have to replace the access token over and over and over again, but instead can keep using the same one. What we're looking at right now is the uh, official uh, Facebook ads documentation. Um, so we can see here, there is a part on access token guide, and it says we can use long lived access tokens. Um, and as I mentioned in the intro, the access token generally lasts about 60 days. Um, so what do we need to do uh, to, 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 to get this done? Well, we need our access token. So one that is short lived right now, then we need a client ID, a client secret, and that's it. Um, so let's uh, go over and just try this out. So I'm going to copy the entire URL up from here and go to the uh, Graph API Explorer. So of course, this uh, entire part um, already includes the graph.facebook, etc. part. I'm just going to copy this over here. So we can see we have grant type. This is not done well. So we want the grant type. And we have a client ID, client secret, and our access token. So the access token we just use from here. Um, we can refresh this if we want to. I'm just going to get a new one. Cool. I'm just going to copy this over here, paste it. And now we need the app secret and app ID. So we get that from our app. So you can go over to my apps. I've already opened this up over here. And when going to the settings and basic part, you can see that we have an app ID over here. So I'm just going to copy that. And then let's take the secret. So of course, this should be secret. So I'm going to reset reset it right after uh, recording this video. So it's not um, compromised. And that should be it. So let's try it out. And there we are. So what you can see now is that we have an access token over here uh, that we found here, and it says it expires in. So I assume this should be seconds. So we can just uh, try this out. So divided by 3000. Uh, 3600 this should be days and then if we sorry hours and this should be days so you can see that we should have this access token for the next 60 days and that's it that's how easy it is uh, make sure you do not compromise your secret you don't share your access token anywhere uh, make sure that you don't share if you're using it inside of a spreadsheet that you don't share the spreadsheet with anybody uh, that you don't want to give access to your ad account